Hey, it's Dr. Greg with Align Wellness Center here in Northbrook, Illinois. Today I want to spend a few minutes going over how or why the scoliosis may progress, particularly in the youth. So um, as we know, scoliosis is a really big concern for the population between 10 and 18 years of age. What happens during that time is a major growth spurt. And if there's an imbalance in the spine, particularly in the mid back, shifting it from one side to the other, there are some principles of bone development and bone growth that wind up kicking in that really progress it fast and furious. Now the major principle that we're talking about here is called the huter goldman principle. And what we see when we look at a normal spine here is that it's straight up and down. So what happens is that both sides of the spine winds up having equal amounts of force on it, coming down from the body above. When we look at someone who has begun to develop a scoliosis, there might be a slight bend, maybe just a 10 degree curve. What happens is that there's more force on the inside of these bones on the curve. And what it winds up doing is slowing the growth plates down so they don't grow as rapidly. The areas on the outside have less force on them, so those areas wind up growing and developing bone more. It causes a feed-forward mechanism of the outside of the curves growing faster and more bone, and the inside of the curves growing less bone and less bone. And as you can see, it begins to cause a structural deformity, not just a cosmetic deformity. When these deformities are understood, checked, and, un and found early, we can actually use this principle to help restore the spine back to an ideal and normal position. But it's got to be found early. So if you or someone you know may have a tilt in their shoulders, or may be getting to shift off a of balance from the middle, or you may have noticed or someone had told you that there was a bend when you did uh, an Adams test, a bend forward test, and you notice one side of the chest is going higher than the other, these are all signs that you should wind up seeing a chiropractor that specializes in scoliosis, understands this deformity, and has studied tools that can wind up changing them. Once again, if you or someone you know has experienced this or is seeing this going on or has questions about how scoliosis progresses, can you please share this video with them so that they can understand the principles of what's going on and then make certain and the right decisions to reverse them. Once again, I'm Dr. Greg Gersten with Align Wellness Center. If you have questions about this, feel free, write them down below. I do my best to answer them as quickly as possible. And I wanna thank you for letting me be a part of your health.